This is your moment of truth. Don't drop your wife to be your soon to be wife. There you go. Get it. Get it. Oh no, he's gonna drop her. <laughs> and now he's gonna laugh. Oh no, Belle. That kind of was your bad though, Belle. Hey everyone, my name's The Clumsy Simmer and welcome back to my channel or just welcome if you are new. This is episode two of my Horse Ranch Let's Play with the Reed Parker family and it is the next day and everyone is waking up and poor little Dylan here actually has a sore tooth, um, a loose tooth actually. And he will probably be losing that tooth soon and little Bailey is very dirty and very hungry, so we will be getting her needs taken care of. She's gonna go wake up Danny. She must love Danny. She said, I'm gonna go wake up Danny or my new daddy over my mommy. And Belle, uh, they should have, I meant to change their friendship or their relationship to 100. Uh, but anyways, yeah, so she is going to get her needs taken care of. She's going to go wake up her new daddy and Belle, she is going to need to wake up. <laughs> wake up, mama. You need to use the bathroom. We're not going to take a pregnancy test. Most likely you're not pregnant. And even if you are, we are going to get surprised and we will wait until she's getting like symptoms and stuff. And okay, change outfits. Oh, so that is actually a functional mirror too. That's pretty cool. Okay, so change outfit. Go ahead and change into your everyday wear. And oh yeah, I forgot. Okay, so she needs to do a grocery order. Order a delivery, order some groceries. And let's see, we definitely, they don't have like too much money. We need to be careful on money actually. Cause I, I'm not gonna do like any cheats or anything in this let's play. Um, all right, so let's do a few of each meats. Let's do a few sugars, no strawberry milk. We don't need milk and we shouldn't need eggs. And that actually, uh, we're going to have the boys go out there and work on the farm in a little bit. And uh, honestly, we can make our own cheese with the milk, I think. And let's get some flour. We can make our own bread. Oh, we also need to get some fruits and veggies started. So we got a lot of work to do, guys. Okay, let's get this done. Um, we are going to be needing some fruits to grow. So let's go ahead and get some berries. Uh, I really don't want elderberry. Uh, okay, let's do elderberry because we might get into herbalism. We'll see. Let's get some grapes, uh, huckleberry. Let's go ahead and get the whole shebang. We're not gonna do no plantains. I don't, that seems tropical to me. And Chestnut Ridge is not tropical. Let's do pomegranate and some raspberries and that strawberry. What's quail fruit? Quail fruit is hard to handle, let alone comfortably carry in your pocket, okay? That don't really tell me what that is. Um, okay, let's get some basil. We're not gonna do, okay, yeah. We're already at 811 bucks, so I need to be careful. Let's look at some veggies. Bell pepper, black bean, carrot, green bean, mushroom, onion, tomato. Let's get the whole package. Okay, 984 bucks and a delivery fee of $20. Man, inflation really hit the Sims world too, huh? All right, so she is ordering that. Uh, she, Bailey here is trying to wake up Danny. And he needs to change her diaper. Aw, oh. He is definitely, they're gonna adopt each other's kids, guys. I didn't even know that was a thing. That is so cute. They're gonna do that once they get married, though. So, toddler care. Change her diaper. Oh. Well, okay. You just go to the bathroom and go work. Go, go to work. You know, make yourself useful. And Bailey, or Belle, <laughs> I'm doing it still. Uh, Belle is going to change her diaper and get her taken care of and give her a bubble bath. And oh, look, there's a cloud, a green cloud. <laughs> and okay, Dylan, oh, you're just having leftover pizza for breakfast. Breakfast of champions, I'll tell you that. Cold pizza is pretty good. And then after that, he is going to take a, sh no, you're not gonna take a shower yet. You need to go work in the yard. Go ahead and clean up that and go out here his chores how's the horse doing his chores is going to be taking care of the chicken coop and collecting the eggs 
Ooh, new family dynamic. When it comes to Belle and Bailey, a sense of order seems to be abound, as the younger Sam has a deep respect for their older family member, often meeting their older Sam's high expectations. For family members with a strict family dynamic, the older Sam will ask the younger Sam to do things like cleaning more, and the younger Sam will generally avoid rebelling, though might get stressed more overall. Okay, so would you say that Bill or... <laughs> Would you say that Belle and Bailey have a strict dynamic? Ooh, uh, yeah. Um, let's just say all these pop-ups that come up, we're just gonna yes them all. Um, that should get interesting. <laughs> so yes, they are strict dynamic. So Bailey is a good little girl. She listens to her mama. All right. Ooh, you got a beard, Danny. Here's the groceries. Get the groceries, Danny. Get the groceries, and then you need to go ahead and eat some leftover pizza as well. And shave that beard back down to your preferred length. We may or may not have Danny Grow's beard, but we'll have to we'll have to wait on that. So, okay. He is eating some pizza. Okay, girl, you can leave my house now. You must be waiting for a tip. We don't have the money. Okay, tip. This is the tipping world. Go ahead and give uh, Kaori a tip. I think that's her name. Yeah, Kaori. And honestly, you ate. Just go ahead and finish that. You need to get to work. It's almost 8 o'clock. You ain't done yet. And you still got to shave. Drink aged nectar. Well, you will eventually. I'll, I'll sh I'm sure of that. Mentor a child skills. Okay, we'll do that later. But you need to get out into the yard and start working but shave your beard first dylan discovered an egg oh oh crap you need to uh take a vacation day little boy yes you're gonna skip school i'm sorry and what's the eggs looking like okay four any hatchable i don't think so go ahead and put those in the fridge and he's got some fertilizer he'll go give over to his dad and uh, once you shave your beard, it's time for you to come over here and clean poor Maribel. This is their cow. I don't think I've introduced you to their cow yet. This is their cow, Maribel. And this is Danny's cow that he brought from Brindleton Bay. He had one over at his parents' house when he lived over there. That's where he was living. And yeah, so he brought her with him. He loves her and he just didn't want to buy another cow, so... We're gonna get into making treats and all that as well. So go ahead and clean her, feed her, milk her. And how's this looking? Clean the shed, refill the feed. And how's it looking over here? There is a bunch of manure. So let's go ahead and put all this up into Danny's inventory. Poor Danny. He's got some stinky, uh, stinky poop in his inventory. Um, that is looking good. What's the horse's needs looking like? She's playing still. She's so playful. And, oh, there's fish. Oh, the quality. I forgot about the fish. <laughs> uh, so let's just sell these. I don't know. Do they have, like, farmer stands in the downtown? So we'll give this to Belle. And she is going to make her way downtown. And she is going to see if she can sell those fish for some money. Uh, put these groceries away. Oh, I don't think... Oh. Does she have to literally put them away? Alright, Dylan, I need your help. Uh, put these away for mom. And she also needs to be... Oh my gosh, there's so much to do. She needs to be making some food for the... Party later. Oh no. Oh no. Why is... Why is Bailey in the... Oh, she's hungry. And she needs to go to the bathroom. Uh, give her those animal crackers. What the heck are you doing? And she is going to eat those. And she's just going to have to poop in her diaper. I know we need to be getting her potty trained. But that's just not happening right now. And Dylan is going to take care of the groceries. And she is going to cook something for the party later. Clean out spoiled food. And cook... Let's see what we are able to cook. Hollow, hollow. I mean, that doesn't really fit the whole Chestnut Ridge vibe, so. Oh, we can't make nothing. Oh, gosh. Oh, my gosh. We can't make anything, guys. I think she needs to make some bread. Can you at least do that? Make bread. 
Oh, he didn't put the groceries up. That's why. Okay, now we can cook and see what we can make. <laughs> Franks and beans. Oh, yeah. That's such a gourmet meal for your engagement party. What a great idea. Okay, so scrambled eggs and bacon, Malaysian saute. I mean, this don't fit the vibe either, but we're just going to have to do what we're going to have to do. And that is way better than Franks and beans. I mean, or should we just be funny and and do franks and beans i don't know i don't know guys uh okay we're gonna do franks and beans because that makes more sense than malaysian saute this sounds like i don't think Belle really is really into cooking anyways oh she don't care she doesn't like it or dislike it she's just neutral on it so she's gonna make some franks and beans oh i got scared i thought he shaved his whole beard i was like no um Oh, his dad. This is Papa. Uh, no, dad. <laughs> Planning a party. Dang. Okay. Belle, your dad needs to challenge himself. Uh, what do you think about a new job? Um, just follow your heart, dad. That's all I can tell you. I don't know right now. <laughs> I'll take some time to consider. Well, that's kind of something that you got to figure out on your own. <laughs> and she needs to... Dylan. Make yourself useful, please. And go ahead and take a shower. Not a, not just a brisk one. Take like a thoughtful shower. And she needs to... Oh, did she just make a single serving? Really? Go ahead and let Belle out. And then you need to make like a freaking party serving of those Franks and beans. What are you thinking? Can we not make Franks and beans anymore? Oh, oh my god. Crap. How did we have an onion? Oh, you used the onion. I forgot. Okay. I need to, uh, I need to, uh, we're just going to order pizza for the engagement party, guys. I'm sorry. That's just what we're going to have to do. We're going to have to order pizza or something like that. And I mean, we can buy a banquet table. Yes. But I don't know. They're kind of, uh, not looking too hot on money right now. Give these over to Danny. So that he can grow some stuff. Strawberries. Sooner or later, guys, the this family is going to be eating good. Let me tell you. Right now, it's a little skibby right now. But they'll make it. They ain't going to starve. I won't let them. They'll eat that cow maneuver. <laughs> Ugh, never mind. I'm not even going to finish that. Okay, so Danny has got some milk. Go ahead and put the milk in the fridge. And then we are going to get the veggies and herbs out. There's the tomato, pomegranate's a tree. There's a grape, strawberry, oh, raspberry, strawberry, carrot, mushroom. There is no rhyme or reason here, guys. Fruits and vegetables galore. I mean, it's just, they're, they're just here. They're, it doesn't make no sense. Did we get blueberries out already? I don't think so. Okay, and now... Oh, Choco Berry. Okay, and then Choco Berry goes here. And these other herbs here can go into the fridge. All right, and I also want to do some fruit trees. Um, let's go ahead and just do the fruit trees right here, I guess. Why not? And after you are done doing what you are doing... Oh, she wants to talk. Uh, go ahead and plant all this. And what about you? Can you help your dad plant yet? No? You need some mental skill. You need to start raising your skills. Oh, you are not doing too well with this mental skill, boy. Uh, go ahead and do your homework. You ain't got nothing else to do. Do homework and... Oh, yeah, here's the elderberries and stuff. Is that a tree? I think it is. We'll treat it like a tree. Oh, it's not. Okay, we'll put it over here then. Herbalism, herbalism. All right, little Bailey, what are you doing? You're just wandering. Okay. You do you, boo-boo. And then... Oh, she really... Okay, we're not going to go to town. We're just going to sell these guys. I'm not going to lie. We got too much crap we got to do. And go ahead and spend some time with Maple. Talk to her. Rub neck. Go ahead and mount. Um, what do you got in your hand? Chips? Uh, what are you holding chips for? Put those in your inventory. And you're going to do some writing before your engagement... <laughs> Uh, you don't even have time to do no writing. Your engagement party is like now. Okay, we need to figure this out, guys. Um, they're going to order some food. There is a grill right here. Uh, can y'all grill like steaks or something? 
grill. Okay, we can grill some stuff. Pan de Campo. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if I said that right or not, but I can't make anything, guys. Nothing. Literally nothing because I just need one vegetable for sausage and peppers. I'm about to steal something over here. <laughs> um, let's just steal this pepper. We'll just buy another one. When we get a little bit more money, we'll do we'll buy another pepper. So they're not gonna have a pepper right now to grow. She is going to make some sausage and peppers because that is all they have to make. And they don't have the money to be just ordering takeout willy-nilly, okay? And then I also kind of wanted to, I mean, it's it's already cute out here. We need a radio out here, however. And I really don't, oh, there is a radio. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, so let's let's see, let's see. Is there party supplies? Generations. Um, I wish they had a party supply category. What about you guys? Um, I feel like that'd be really useful. Honestly, we're just gonna, we're just gonna do it. <laughs> Well, this is it. This is the party. Um, go ahead and play. Turn on ranch music, but it sucks, guys, because there's only one ranch music song that is copyright free. So it's going to be the same song over and over again. Hopefully y'all don't mind. It's better than nothing. And poor Danny, he's working. He's working his little butt off right on his engagement party day. You'll, you'll be fine. Grilling up some sausage and peppers for my engagement party. And, oh, we also wanted to have some drinks. We need some nectar. Oh my gosh. Um, come on, Belle. We have literally 10 minutes. We need to go pick up some nectar really quick. <laughs> Hopefully we have time. Um, where is the nectar stall, guys? I think it's here. So, okay, let's go to Duke's Hall. Alrighty, guys. Here we are. And don't even... Oh! Yeah, don't even unpause. We literally have 10 minutes. Like, that is not enough time to do anything. Uh, I'm gonna have to teleport. I said no cheats, but teleporting, that's different. All right, where is the... I haven't played in Chestnut Ridge or anything in so long. Here it is. This is where you uh, buy... Oh, there is a grocery store. I think that's where you buy nectar, right? I literally have no time to spare. Okay, save, 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 save. I might have to come back. Um, or is it like that old guy that sells the nectar? Someone sells the nectar and I don't know who. Okay, teleport. Teleport here. Usually um, they give me like a notification that says, uh, come buy some nectar from here. I think it's that old guy, isn't it? The old like weird looking guy. Oh, Belle, we don't have time for this. No nectar, there's no nectar. Crap. <sighs> okay. It's not looking good, guys. Uh, we're gonna have to figure something else out, I guess. We're just gonna have to... 12 p.m. That's when the party's supposed to start. What happens? Why is the party not started? Is it because she wasn't home? Crap. Okay. Engagement dinner. Let's go ahead and, uh, redo it. Guess we're inviting everybody. And then celebration, dancing, we're gonna be drinking, desserts, have toasts. Okay home now go Alrighty, guys we are having the party so we never did find any nectar guys oh my gosh i'm so sorry to the family the nectar is so important we don't have any down here do we uh no i could have sworn i stocked this with nectar before i posted it on the gallery but maybe i didn't there's nothing in any of this stuff. Okay, so a little bit of change of plans. We are going to get the, whatchamacallit, the punch from Discovery University. That's what we're going to do. We actually already have a thing of that punch. So what do you guys think about me not buying any more and using this one? You know what? Let's leave it there. Some people, no, we're going to take it. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm indecisive. All right, so this is the punch station. <laughs> there it is. Right there. Oh, it's floating. Punch station. We gotta have enough room to do some keg stands, so. Here. Here's the punch. This is where the punch is going to stay. All right. What an engagement party, guys. Wow. 
You know what? When you have love, you don't need the material things, right? So let's go ahead and go here together. And there is the radio on. Call attendees to activity. Let's dance, everybody. Let's do some cowpoke dancing. Cowpoke to together. Come on, everyone. Oh. Oh, I forgot. They actually, she hasn't even met her uh, future mother and father-in-law. Why are you guys sad? Um, friendly introduction. And do one to him as well. Friendly introduction. He is going to come and talk to his dad and say, Hey, Pops. Long time no see. It's been so long. Deep conversation and go ahead and hug your dad too. Hey, mom. Hug lovingly and then Belle is also going to hug her dad. Um, and then Belle, here is her new grandparents. Come talk to stranger. They're strangers right now, but won't always be. And okay, now it is time to go dance. How you doing, little kid? Uh, can you cowpoke? Can kids cowpoke? They can't? Aww. That's kind of dumb. Okay. That would have been so cute seeing the kids cowpoke dance, wouldn't it have been? Um, all right, everyone. We don't want you dancing up there. You have to come dance down here. All right. Well, She's so cute, isn't she, Bailey? Um, stranger danger. Oh, that's not good. Go ahead and uh, make your way over here. Danny. Oh my goodness. Grandpa is getting it, boy. Go ahead and cowpoke dance. You. You made Danny fall in love with you while you were cowpoke dancing, girl. So you know what you're doing. Come on. Let's see it. Let's see those moves. There you go, girl. There you are. Yeah, you are getting married, Belle. I would so be dancing like that, too. <laughs> if I was, like, actively planning my wedding. I am engaged, but we're not having any plans right now. Dang, Belle. You're even going through the freaking grill, girl. You ain't playing. There's Grandpa and Dylan and Dylan. Dylan just loves Grandpa. <laughs> Invite Grandpa to dance. Bright and day. Go ahead and do some hip bumping. You just need to go ahead and get all... You need to goof around. Get your relationship up with Grandpa. Why are you crying, baby? We are trying to have a party here. Go ahead. Just eat some... Uh, Sausage and peppers, but if you didn't like chicken nuggets, I'd be surprised if you liked that. Okay, so go here. And mom and dad, what are you guys doing? Come join the party. Call over. Call over. Let's go ahead and uh, tap this as well. And. Yeah, this is the party, guys. This is it. <laughs> what a great party. Um, they really need to make some new friends. <laughs> okay, so Papa Reed would like to come over to hang out. Is that okay? I mean, yeah, you're kind of already here, Grandpa or Papa. Papa Reed and Danny Reed is swell. And, or Papa Reed thinks Danny Reed is swell and wants to be, become best friends. Oh yeah. Oh, Danny. <laughs> Danny, dang. All right. So, Belle, you need to get to know your new parent-in-law. Let's do some joking. Joke about vampires. Tell a funny story. And what else? Let's see. Let's see. Oh, tell a gross joke. I think Pop will be into it. And then go over to Nana. She ain't gonna like the nasty jokes though. So tell a joke about Horace, of course. Oh, what a good one. What a good one. Who thought of that? And then joke about politicians too, because there there's a lot of things to joke about with them. Um, Belle, Bailey, Bailey, baby. What is the problem? 
You need to, I need to get a toy from her room and bring down here because I think she's bored. Where's her room at? Here it is. Um, there's a little rancher doll right there. I can't play with that. Okay, you're gonna play with your little nesting blocks then. Let's do shapes. And Dylan, are you hungry? Yeah, go ahead and eat. Everyone's kind of eating. Let's eat food. Grab a serving. I wish we could listen to more of the ranch music because some of it is really good. This is a pretty good one for it being copyright, though, so that's good. Alrighty, so... Congratulations, guys. Um, are we still not tap this? Okay, Belle's gonna have to get that taken care of. Cause Danny couldn't do it. <laughs> he could not do it. Um, can you ask your grandpa? Oh, they can wrestle? Oh my gosh, what does that look like? I've never seen that. Okay, let's see. Come on, come on, Bailey. Come on, grandpa, finish that sausage. Eat it. Hurry up. Belle. Can nobody do this? Tap that juice keg. I don't think the kid can. Yeah, that, that'd be funny if uh, none of the adults could do it, but the kid could do it. Okay. Um, wrestle with Grandpa. I want to see that. Come on. Fast forward. Let's see. Wrestle. Aww. Aww. Okay, so it's basically just play. And the, maybe since she's energetic, it's called wrestle. But isn't that so cute? Aww, she loves her grandpa. And she's going to love her new papa and nana too. Aww. I think that's not nana nana. That's cute. Okay. What you doing, Belle? Did you get this tapped? Tap that. What is y'all's problem? <laughs> and then Dylan. Where you at, Dylan? You're just there talking to Grandma. Go ahead and do be a be a good boy and clean up those plates for your parents. Did you finally tap this? Oh my gosh. All right. Grab a cup of. Let's do a keg stand. Uh, let's have Danny hold her. Don't drop her. This is your test, Danny. Are you going to be able to do it? Let's see. Come on. Hurry up. Fast forward. Let's. Are you guys going to do the keg stand or not? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Here they go. Don't drop her, Danny. This is your moment of truth. Don't drop your wife to be your soon to be wife. There you go. Get it. Get it. Oh, no. He's going to drop her. <laughs> and now he's going to laugh. Oh, no, Belle. That kind of was your bad, though, Belle. Um, you kind of tried to chug more than you could. <laughs> so grab a cup of juice. And Danny is going to grab a cup of juice as well. Go ahead and fill some cups. And aw, look! Nana and Papa, they're so cute. They are so in love still. Alright, let's go ahead and get their relationships up. The Gen Z Kimbalaya. It almost sounded like she said the Gen Z. What are you, are you talking crap about Gen Z? I don't, honestly, guys, I'm in between the millennial and Gen Z category, and so I'm really not, uh, I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm, I was born in 97, so I've seen both. I'm millennial, the very end of it, or the very beginning of Gen Z, so I don't know. I'm, I'm a, I'm a misfit. <laughs> I'm not an either one. Anybody else born in 97 that kind of have the same, uh, problem? All right, so Dylan, what are you doing? Well, that was that was the party. I guess the party's over now. Let's go ahead and uh, turn the music off. And I'm so glad you guys could make it. Uh, thank your guest, Belle. Where are you going? 
I'm so glad you couldn't make it, Nana. I hope that uh, you enjoyed the party and um, have you heard, by the way? Have you heard about all of the people in town drinking too much nectar? Um, yeah, I hear that they make fools of themselves. <laughs> and uh, I'm, I, I'm a pretty good drinker. I don't, uh, I don't drink too much, Nana. You don't got to worry about that. <laughs> Your son's safe. Don't worry. And, uh, okay. Sim of, no, you're not that close. Oh, they're hugging. And go ahead and send home. Bye, Nana. And Papa, where are you at? Did Papa leave? Grandpa's leaving. Nana's leaving. Papa left. Okay. And Grandpa's leaving as well. So it's time to wind down after that fun party. And there is some little more ch chores to do. Belle actually wants to get some... Let's go ahead and clean Maple's hooves. And go ahead and mount her because... Uh, let's be honest, Belle, she has been slacking ever since they moved and everything's been all crazy and now they had their engagement party. She has been not horse back riding very often, so she needs to work on that. And little Bailey here, honestly, what are your skills looking like? Um, you kind of need to work on your imagination, so go ahead and go up here and play with this dollhouse in your brother's room i'm sure he wouldn't mind and how about yours oh you need to do your homework buddy because you have to go to school tomorrow so do your homework and he wants to read to a child so we'll work on that some other time clean up a little bit and let's, let's get some of this cow manure around this place huh let's get that and let's water all what are these what did i plant here oh basil why does that look different why is why does that look like that is it my reshade no oh uh, i don't know and you also need to finish planting these um we are we're slacking big time lifelong aspirations yes i know i know about that so this whole f row right here we're gonna do just like individual plants and I think starting here, we're gonna do some of these overcropped seeds because that is how you make some good money. So we're gonna get, let's go ahead and get two of each. Get two of each and start planting. I'm gonna get these planted and I'll see you guys after that. All right, so Danny is finished or busy. Okay, hold on, Papa Reed. Dylan, I just found out about this concert at an abandoned warehouse. We can't miss this, let's go. Um, Papa. You're trying to bring him out on a school night to a concert? I'm sorry, Papa, but that's a no. At an abandoned warehouse? Listen, I trust you, Papa, but I don't trust the other people there, so we can't go. And he's working on his homework. All right, Belle, so let's go for an intense ride. <laughs> Belle's pretty talented when it comes to horseback riding. She's been riding horses her whole life. Um... Her horse here, she actually raised from a little foal. Is it foal or fowl? I don't know. She raised from a little foal and trains her everything she knows. So let's see. Let's go to relationships. Um, where is... <laughs> okay, there. And let's her open her profile. So she's got some work that needs to be done. Uh, she isn't that old of a horse yet, and so we need to work on her agility, jumping, and endurance, and of course temperament too, but that, that just comes over time, if I'm not mistaken. She has not won any competitions, so we are going to try to work on the competitions as well. So she is going for an intense ride, and when she gets back home after that, we will go ahead and do some, either some agility or some jumping, one or the other. Danny, how are you looking? Get done, Danny. It's getting dark out here, buddy. All right, Dylan. Um, we need to improve your mental skill. So you really need something for that. You don't have... All right, let's be real. He's not, he's not a creative kid. We need to get something for his mental skill. So let's get a junior wizard set. 
Let's do blue and that should fit right here. Pretty perfect, okay. So there is his little wizard set and come up here Dylan and play your game so that you can help your dad plant some vegetables and stuff because you have to do that before you can plant stuff apparently, which doesn't really make any sense to me. <laughs> All right, we are back home guys and Belle is actually gonna ride over here and do some jumping with Mabel. So let's go ahead and practice basic jumping because she doesn't really have much skill right now so let's do that and danny must be done is he done planting okay honestly you need to go ahead and water this too and you also need to give encouragement and fertilize go ahead and fertilize we need to buy some fertilizer oh we don't have money so let's go ahead and wait till we can make a little bit more money first and so dylan is up here doing his mental stuff how's Belle doing she really needs to be put to sleep parents are busy I'm sorry that's sad but she's just gonna put herself to sleep all right let's see how Belle does oh they got it all right guys so there's not much to show right here so I'm gonna go ahead and do some training with Belle and Maple and uh yeah I'll see you guys after that all right, guys. Well, it's pretty late now, so I really don't even know what time it is. So it's <laughs> okay. Yeah, you need to get off Maple and go put your poor daughter to sleep. She wants like a bedtime story or something. So let's go ahead and you know what? Dylan's going to do it or uh, Danny, because he wants his aspiration is to read to a child for a while. So. Let's go ahead and read a toddler to sleep and read toddler to sleep. Okay. And what about you, Dylan? You need to go potty. Your tooth is loose still. Okay. That's going to be for two days and go ahead and use the bathroom. And then it's late. So go ahead and go to sleep. And what about you, Belle? Dismount. Oh, she's got low hunger and low energy, so she needs to go eat, and Belle's going to go have a, some leftover so No, she's just going to eat in the morning, and she's going to go upstairs and use the bathroom and then go to sleep. Oh, Danny's got to go to the bathroom. All right. So here we are. Danny is going to read to little Bailey and then he is going to go to the bathroom and go to sleep. Now the whole household is pretty much going to sleep and I'll see you guys in the morning. Well, it is the morning and little Bailey is awake already. Girl, go back to sleep. You're not even fully rested. And then Dylan, he is needing to get up to get ready and go to school. So go ahead and go out here and do your chores really quick, which is collect eggs, clean coop, and scatter some feed. All right, so Dylan's going to go take care of his morning chores. And then after that, he is going to go ahead and eat something because he should eat something before school, get leftovers. And how is Bailey looking? And then Dylan, it's about, or Dar Danny, <laughs> uh, Danny, it's about time for him to get up as well and go ahead and get some morning breakfast. It doesn't look like you need to shave today. And then it's going to be the same old stuff that we did yesterday, guys. That's <clears throat> this, uh, you know, keeping up with the farm is definitely going to get repetitive. So I may or may not show it every single time. But for now, um, yeah, this is what we are doing. We're going to go ahead and clean that shed. And why is Maple sad? Hold up. Pause. <laughs> You're moving too much. Social is low. That's why. Because Belle needs to get her butt up. All right. So I'm going to finish taking care of their needs. And I'll see you guys after that. All right, guys. Well, I'm back. We pretty much, their needs are pretty bad still. Um, but we ha finally have enough food in the house for... Bell to make breakfast. <laughs> so she's making some pancakes and poor Dylan 
He already left for school, so he's gonna work work normally. Bailey's still sleeping. Danny is actually out. He's gonna be working in the yard and stuff, so he won't be eating these pancakes. He already ate some leftover franks and beans anyway, so he's pretty good. Um, all right, and then ba Belle is gonna go ahead and eat some pancakes, and we will put them in fr the fridge until Bailey gets up. So when Belle is done eating, she is going to give Bailey a bath and I think here in a little bit we are going to adopt a dog probably when Dylan gets home from school but um she also needs to come out here and spend some time with Mabel as well but <coughs> okay go ahead and eat your pancakes hurry up and then after that you are going to you're done give Belle bath Give Belle a bubble bath. Or Bailey, I mean. Wow, I really shouldn't have. <laughs> Note to self, don't name the names of the family members so close because you are going to constantly call them the wrong name. That is what I've been doing this whole series so far. Okay, and... He wants to chat with Grandpa. Aww. Oh, Danny's getting stinky. And go ahead and plant your <coughs> your last uh, oversized seed thing. And you got some more planting to do over here. Um, I think. I don't know. I was going to say Belle needs to start helping him with this. But she's busy doing a lot of stuff too. She's taking care of little Bailey. And she's got to focus on her horses too. And go ahead and uh, let's fertilize. What should we fertilize? The best thing. I don't know. Just something random. Um, fertilize with normal manure. Are you guys... Why did you put her in the high chair? Yes, he likes gardening. Good. That's going to help us out a lot. Now he's going to gain fun as he's doing that. And put down. Talk. Um, how about you give your daughter a bath? Get bubble bath. Let's go ahead and do it one more time just to make sure, you know, just to make sure. Um, why are they glitching out with these bowls so often? I'm about to delete the high chair, to be honest. Uh, we really don't even need it, and we could use those simoleons back. So ho go ahead, get her out of there. We're going to sell this because you guys don't know how to handle it. You guys don't know how to handle it. Are you done working out here? You're not allowed to. You need to encourage crop growth because we are trying to have the highest quality produce one can buy because we need all that money that we can get. And after that, <laughs> um, you need to go fishing because we can make money that way too. Go ahead and try to give her a bubble bath now that she finally ate something. Give Bailey a bubble bath. Okay. She wants to change baby's, Bailey's diaper. So she's got a stinky diaper. Go ahead and change that baby's diaper. All right, buddy. Oh, you got the egg still? Oh, no. Okay, good. They're good still. Oh, he got a drawing from his first day of school. Um, He's going to give that to his new mom. And... Uh-uh. Go ahead and friendly. Uh, what do you guys think it's under? Affectionate? Yeah, give gift. Friendly gift. Oh, you can't give her that? Okay, well, we're just going to pretend that he gave that to his mom. And she's going to hang it up here in the kitchen. Like, right here or something. That's cute. We'll do right there. Right where she can see it when she's cooking. Because that's her favorite. <laughs> that's her favorite counter to do dinner on. And go ahead and give your dad that fertilizer. He could use it. All right, buddy. This is it. We're going to pull that tooth out once and for all. Wiggle it. We're going to wiggle it at least. Go ahead and wiggle it. Did you guys ever do that as a kid? I did. I think I <laughs> literally tied it to a doorknob handle one time and like yanked it out with a dental floss or, you know, tied a string around it. I think I really did that. Did you wiggle it? Nothing happened. Can you wiggle it again? You know what? 
go ahead. Spend some time with Mabel. She she needs it. She's a good girl. Can kids? Oh, they can. I don't think I've seen a kid ride a horse yet. I'm actually pretty curious. What? Hurry up. I want to see it. Oh, that's so cute. Oh my gosh. Here we go. Here we go. Come on. Oh, oh my gosh. I did not expect it to be that cute. Oh my gosh, that was adorable. Why have I not... Oh, Papa wants to come over? Yeah, come on over, Papa. Why have I not thought about having a, a kid ride a horse? That's so cute. All right. Go ahead and go for a relaxed ride. Are you... Okay. Um, give Bailey a bubble bath. There's a dirty diaper on the ground. Let's, uh, yeah, let's uh, throw that away. And Dylan, or Danny, I mean. Oh, is that his dad walking up the stairs? Yeah. Let's go ahead and talk to dad a little bit. Let's do some bragging about the ranch. And also let's uh, make a joke to him. Let's do a knock knock joke, why not? Um, here we go. Listen, dad. I don't want to make it sound like I'm like bragging or anything, but I just need to tell you how hard I've been working in this ranch and it's really coming along good, Pop. You have taught me good and let me tell you, thank you. I just want to say thank you. And that's it. <laughs> that's it. Um, and then Bailey, she's over here giving Belle Oh, Belle is giving Bailey a bath. Oh my gosh. Okay, I really need to work on that. I need to start really thinking about it more. I keep calling them the wrong name. Um, Belle is giving Bailey a bath. Isn't that the cutest thing ever? And has a little sponge. She's washing her hair and stuff. Um, I guess on that note, guys, this would be a good time to end this part right here. Uh, yeah. Tell me, are you guys enjoying this? Are you guys enjoying the characters and getting to know the characters and stuff? Um, we are. We do still have a wedding to plan. And so that is something we are going to be working on next episode. We are going to do some other party. Not the wedding yet. We'll do uh, maybe some batch parties or something. We'll do something fun. And we'll do a couple days next time as well. So I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, then make sure to leave a like so I know to keep making these videos. And also, subscribe to my channel and ring the notification bell so that you don't ever miss a video again. And I hope you guys have an amazing rest of your day or night. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.